Hey everybody, welcome back to the garage. Uh, today we're going to put some Beam Tech LED headlights into our uh, 2008 Ford Explorer. Um, it's pretty easy. Uh, you got to take the headlights out, the headlight bucket out, and uh, and change the bulbs. So uh, just stick around, and uh, we're going to show you how we're going to change these out. All right, we'll be using these uh, Beam Tech LED lights that I got on Amazon. Uh, they're not too bad. Um, they're X. They're 6500K, which is the the color the color of the bulb. They're 8,000 lumens and they're 30,000 hours. So uh, we're gonna put these in and see how these look. Uh, they're not too bad. Uh, open the box up for you here. Comes with instructions. Comes with an Allen key, so that way you can adjust them. I always like to buy the bulbs that are adjustable because that way it depends on what kind of uh, headlight you have. You can always adjust the bulb so the beam is just right. So here's what's in the package. Two bulbs. Really nice. Pretty much plug and play. So uh, we're going to get the headlight out. Actually in these Ford Explorers you have uh, two bolts, two 10 millimeters. You got to take these out, slide the headlight out, put the bulb in itself. These are also CAN bus ready which also means that they won't give any false signals to your computer letting you know that the headlights are out. So uh, let's get started and getting these uh, beam tech bulbs in. All right, you take out these two 10 millimeter bolts on these Ford Explorers. That one, Set that one aside, on the front. Actually, I'm gonna to need to get an extension. So I don't know if I can get in there or not. Actually, I got in there. Next one, I have to get an extension on there. Um, these had LEDs in them before. They're kind of giving me some problems. So, uh, well, actually, there's a lot. There's one more down there yet. There's three of them. These two top ones and a bottom one. Uh, I'm going to get an extension. I'm going to get this one out. Then I'll show you how the, how the light comes out. All right, I got the two top bolts out. Uh, there's a bottom bolt down in there. You can see it's not too hard. You just got to need a long extension. Um, that one you don't need to take out completely. You just need to loosen it. And once you loosen all that, well, loosen that one up and take these two out, it pretty much slides right out. Just like, just like that. So here's an old style LED I have in here that was giving me problems. So we're gonna take these out and we're going to put our new ones in. So they're pretty much plug and play on these. Just like that, you plug them, uh, unplug them. So uh, let me get my new ones in and I'll show you how that goes. All right, I got the old bulb out. All you gotta do is untwist it. Pretty much grab your new one, get it in there, get it lined up. Pretty easy. Twist it in, I'm not sure if you guys can see it, but twist it in. Plug it into the wiring harness. And I looked through the lens, it's actually lined up just perfect. This one worked, uh, this one worked out pretty good. And uh, gotta try to get everything back in there. Kinda. Make sure you get it on the bottom bolt, way down in there. And there's a little pin on the side here, you gotta line that up too. There we go. Bulbs in, it's on the bottom bolt. Put our two top bolts in and tighten everything down and that's pretty much it when it's changing uh, putting led bulbs in uh, it's really quick and easy uh, as long as there's no clearance issues on the bulb itself but uh it's the same for the other side just take it out take two bolts out bottom bolt, slide it out put the new bulb in and you're good to go so the that's pretty much it guys Thank you guys for watching. Um, as you can see, the headlights are a lot brighter than the other ones. Um, thank you for watching. Turn on the post notifications and subscribe. Our latest video is up here. And you're watching Here's Hope and Garage.